This week in AI has been absolutely wild. So many exciting new developments have just dropped. Let's dive right in with Google's generative Omnimate. This tool is incredibly powerful. It can analyze a video and break it down into individual layers. Imagine isolating a person's head and hands onto separate layers. That's exactly what this AI can do. And it's not just for single objects. It can handle complex scenes like separating each boy in a group or even multiple penguins, giving each its own layer. But wait, there's more. Generative Omnimat understands context. It doesn't just detect hands in a video. It also includes their shadows in each layer. Plus, it can distinguish between hands from different people, creating separate layers for each person. Take a car driving down the road, for example. Omnimat separates the car and includes its shadow and dust trail, all in the same layer. So, when you remove the car, the shadow and dust disappear too. Talk about attention to detail. Even if objects are partially blocked in the video, like a person obscured by someone in front, this AI can still generate a clean, separate layer for that person seamlessly throughout the video. Now, what can you do once you've separated the video into these layers? A ton of creative editing. Remove distracting objects, turn a layer into just its edges for a cool effect, swap out backgrounds entirely, or even resize individual layers. Since each penguin is on its own layer, you can resize them independently, making some bigger, some smaller. It even handles reflections, so if the penguins are reflected on the ground, the reflections scale correctly too, and it gets even crazier. You can duplicate a person on a layer to create an awesome echo effect, remove just the hands from a video while keeping the rest intact, or take a skater and add multiple duplicates for a cool motion blur effect. Imagine removing a person from a scene but keeping the cardboard box they were holding perfectly suspended in mid-air. Generative Omnimat fills in the gap seamlessly. You can even make a person disappear, leaving only a plane seemingly floating in the air. Here's another awesome trick. Imagine a video of people jumping, but they're out of sync. With generative Omnimate, you can place each person on their own layer and adjust the timing so they all jump and land at the exact same time. This tool just came out as a preprint, so there's no GitHub or Hugging Face link yet, but hopefully it'll be open sourced soon. Next up is something truly mind-bending, Cat4D from Google DeepMind. This AI is already making waves and for good reason. It takes a standard 2D video and generates a full 4D scene from it. That means you can view the video from different perspectives. They've released some examples, and it's remarkable how consistent everything looks across the entire video. Creating a 4D scene from a single 2D video is no easy feat. The AI has to infer unseen information, like what the back of a character looks like. With tricky camera movements like a full orbit around a character, there might be some flaws, especially at the back. But with slight panning or small camera adjustments, the results are incredibly consistent. And get this, it even works with 3D animations. It's not perfect yet. The resolution is a bit low and there are some noticeable flaws in certain generations, but it's a strong start. On their page, they've included interactive examples where you can drag your mouse to view the video from different angles. It looks fantastic when focusing on the front, though extreme angles might show some deformation around the edges and background. They also have an example with an S-video, showing impressive consistency even with different video formats. Despite some flaws with extreme camera angles, it's still amazing that the AI can predict an entire 3D scene from a single video. Here's the truly mind-blowing part. It doesn't just work with videos. You can also input a sequence of images, feed it three frames of someone walking upstairs, and Cat4D can generate a 4D video from that. You can tweak settings like the view or time, fix the camera angle and watch the subject move, freeze time and move the camera around a static scene, or have both the view and time change for a dynamic 4D experience. They've included several examples demonstrating these possibilities. A few weeks ago, I featured a similar AI called Dimension X, which turns images into 3D scenes. Cat4D takes this to the next level by working with video as well. Just like Omnimate, Cat4D has just been released, so there's no hugging face or GitHub link yet. Now let's talk about two new AI tools shaking up the world of 3D design and image manipulation. First, meet Material Anything. This AI tool is a game changer for creating realistic materials for 3D models. 
It generates something called physically based rendering, or PBR, materials. These materials make 3D models look and react to light just like real objects. So, what exactly are PBR materials? They have four key properties. Albedo. This is the base color of the material. Roughness. This controls how smooth or rough the surface appears, affecting its reflectivity. Metallic. This defines how shiny and reflective the surface is, similar to metals. Bump. This adds surface details, creating textures and imperfections. Material Anything handles all of these properties seamlessly. Here's how it works. Start with a blank model. You provide a blank 3D model and a text prompt. For example, if you input metal armor, the AI generates shiny metallic looking armor. Customize with prompts. Say you want a rusty orange robot. The AI will create a robot with a convincingly rusted surface. Enhance existing models. If you have a porcelain teapot that doesn't quite look realistic, just provide the right prompt, and Material Anything transforms it into a lifelike porcelain object. Change textures easily. Whether you want wood, gold, or stone textures, the AI adjusts the albedo, roughness, metallic, and bump properties based on your description. One of the best things about PBR textures is their adaptability to different lighting conditions. This means your 3D models will look realistic in various environments, whether it's for animation, video games, or virtual reality. Material Anything makes creating detailed and realistic 3D models faster and easier than ever. While their GitHub page is currently empty, the creators plan to release the code soon, so keep an eye out for updates. Next, let's dive into Omini Control, another groundbreaking AI tool. Omini Control is a style transfer AI tool. It takes an input image of an object and places it into a new scene based on your text prompt. For instance, give it an image of an orange in a bowl and prompt a close-up view of this item placed on a wooden table. The background is a dark room, the TV is on, the screen is showing a cooking show. Omini Control seamlessly integrates the orange and bowl into that scene. Another example, an image of a toy car. Prompt, a film-style shot on the moon. This item drives across the moon's surface. A flag on it reads, Omini. The car appears on the moon's surface with the specified flag. It's not perfect, but it preserves the car's details remarkably well. Or take a yellow clock image and prompt, This item is placed on a shiny glass table with a vase of flowers. The clock appears on the table. Its shape and features maintained. Omini Control is also great for adding clothes to models or creating product photos. You can give it an image of a shirt and prompt, On the beach, a lady sits under a beach umbrella. She is wearing this shirt. The sun is setting. The shirt is seamlessly added to the woman in the image, with the pattern accurately rendered. This works for various clothing items, even those with complex patterns. Though it's not always flawless with intricate designs, this AI has huge potential for product photography. You can place a red chair, a vase of roses, or even a stuffed chicken in various environments with simple text prompts. It maintains the object's details while adapting to the new setting. It even handles challenging objects like a patterned stuffed animal, a uniquely colored toy car, a complex robot toy, and an iridescent shoe with reflections when placed on a mirror. This makes it perfect for generating diverse product photos. Omini Control uses Flux Schnell as its base model and currently supports a 512 by 512 resolution with plans for higher resolutions in the future. There's a free hugging face space where you can try it out. Just upload an image, add a prompt, and generate your new image. That's a wrap on these incredible AI tools. If you found this video helpful and want to see more content like this, give it a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you never miss out on future updates and explorations into the world of AI. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.